What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. We're back here on Flint Hills and hopefully have a sunny day to get some planting done. But let's get the episode started guys. Alright guys, so I hope everyone's had a good Christmas so far. Well, so far it's already been and gone now. I hope everyone had a good Christmas and hopefully everyone's going to have a good New Year's. Hopefully 2021 is going to be a little bit better for everyone. Um, we're not going to be locked indoors, hopefully, as much. However, today, we've got to do a quick bit of sheep work, and then, hopefully, we can get in the field. However, there are some big changes on the farm. Number one is this shed here. So it ends up, I'm not sure what's happened, but because of the new computer I got, um, luckily it came just before Christmas, but just around work, I wasn't able to get it set up in time. However, we had to go with some new bales, and I think I've got the right amount. Obviously, because these are now a smaller capacity, they're half the capacity of what they originally were, so I've done twice as many bales. So I think I've got the right amount here. However, I wasn't sure if it was due to getting a new computer and obviously moving the save game over, or if I'd done something and maybe I just they disappeared, maybe. But I thought, just to be on the safe side, I'm going to try a new shed, and I'm going to put it here. So this is going to be like the animal shed. I'm going to leave the forklift in here and then the front loader and later on I will bring in all the attachments for the front loader and put them in here. Just so that every, every, everything's in one spot. Whether that's that there. Um, cheap stayed exactly the same, they haven't changed. However, the one big the one big bit that has changed is our brand new pickup. So, if I'm honest guys, I did record an episode, however, I wasn't satisfied with how it went. I didn't think it was good enough. So, basically... I haven't put it on YouTube and one of the things in it was it was a rainy day so we went and brought a lot of equipment so we've put a down payment on a combine we're going to be buying which I can't wait to show you guys hopefully that'll be in here in the next couple days so we should have that shortly and we can really show it off it's, not going, to be, it's going to definitely be by harvest but we're not going to be harvesting for a while so we won't be able to get it straight in the field as soon as we get it but at least it's ready for when we need it and the other aspect was this truck here. So our truck broke down and I've decided to go with this. The 2017 Ford F250. I think it looks absolutely amazing. If you have a look here, we've got the folding steps. We've got the fold-out mirrors. Oh, this truck's going to be amazing. However, what we're going to do is the main bit of today is going to be planting. That is the big bit. The main bit of today I want us to do is planting just so that we're ready but whatever happens, we're cropping the ground because we're running out of time. Give a look here, not here. I need to come back to that one though. We're running out of time. Should start getting stuff ready. Need to get these last two fields done and then we should be good to go. So what I'm going to do guys is I'm going to quickly get all the sheep stuff done. Just get the food, water and the wool done. And then we should be good to get started. So I'll be catch you guys in a second. Okay, so that's us all sorted on the sheep now. Hopefully, they'll be good for the day now. Fed, watered, the whole lot. So they should be good for the day now. So we shouldn't have to worry about them. For me, we can actually get quite a lot done in the field. And I'm hoping, if I park correctly, at least, try this again. Not the straightest, but it will do. Right, all done there. My plan for today is let's try and get as much soybean planting done as possible. Hopefully, we'll get everything. Hopefully, we don't have any rain coming. Wait, look here. Six, nine, three o'clock, we have rain. So we should have time to get a good amount done. Is the plan. Really hoping we'll get enough done. Hmm. Are we going to have enough? We definitely need to get this sorted anyway. I need to get this repainted a little bit because I don't really feel like we're doing this track of justice by letting it drive around with windows like this. So, yeah, I think we're going to change that quickly. Let me just make sure we're all good for fuel before we get to fuel. What the heck have I done now? So, I don't know what it is, but this planter does not like these, this, these doors on any of the buildings. I don't know what it is, maybe it's the model, I'm not sure. Um, right, let's, I've really done this in an awkward way here. Okay, 
guess some will do for fuel. So I'm going to put that shield drive around this way, and then hopefully we'll be all good. We should do a bit of paint work, and then we'll get straight into the field with it. Because, as always, if you're enjoying the series so far, and doing any of the other videos we've got, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to the channel, because it always helps me, and lets me know that you guys are enjoying what we're doing here. Obviously, if you guys have any suggestions or any mods that you'd like to see as well, make sure you pop them in the comments below, because this is going to be our series that we're trying to test some bigger equipment on. And next season is really when I want to get that bigger equipment in, so that we can really kind of enjoy it. Let's try and open the gate. The gate, sharp. Probably the better word. There we go. Let's quickly back this up. This is going to struggle getting in here as well, isn't it? Oh, maybe not. But maybe I might just leave this in here from now on because. This is probably the it's, it's the main track because we're always taking it in the shop, which sounds really bad. It's like we're definitely not doing our job right, but everything seems to be going well, at least when I do do stuff. So I'm going to quickly get a quick bit of paint on this and then we'll get straight into the field, guys. I'll be back with you in a minute. Alright, guys, that is us all good to go. We are finally ready to go get in this field. So, guys, let's cue the time lapse and let's get into this field. Peace. 